Ja Guide Me by Dare. Out now on all platforms. Growing up, I was surrounded by family who taught me about life and love. A family that shaped me into who I am today. Into Dare. Photo albums are a safe haven for some of life's sweetest snapshots, bursting with beautiful glimpses of treasured memories. Hmm. I like looking through them from time to time to remind me of those unforgettable people I hold dear to my heart. This is a picture of my mom when she was much younger. Uh, you can see the classic hair, hairdo, as they would call it. You may have seen this hairstyle in Ja Guide Me, so maybe this is where the inspiration came from. The life lessons I learned from my late father, Atalade, at such an early age, they've all given me the wisdom and strength to navigate this world. They have especially guided me on this journey of raising a family of my own. You see images of my dad, mostly at work, you know, maybe with friends or uh, entertainers like himself, big grin on his face. I'm still in awe, you know. Um, I, I don't think I can really understand how much of an enigma he was. Um, a, lot, a lot of things that I've uh, grown to learn about him um, has been after his demise. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in welcoming the lost son of Nigerian music, the one and only Art Alade. So it's either things I've read about or seen on, on uh, old VHS recordings. I had a music homework from school, secondary school. I had just um, uh, enrolled you know, in, in the secondary school that he also actually went to the CMS Grammar School. brought homework home music one day and I think we sat at the piano and he was just showing me one or two things you know regarding music. I guess that um, whatever I picked up from him is really um, how do I is it spiritual or you know in terms of in the genes you know or whatever. My kids mean the world to me. Anytime I hear one of my children call me dad or daddy <laughs> I feel this sense of love and gratitude. They keep me on my toes and I also keep them on their toes. So whether it's playing practical jokes on each other or teasing them over something, they often get to see my fun side. Femo yellow. <laughs> We played for him his, his first single when he was. How old was he? Mommy, how old was he? Mommy, how old was he when he. Femo <laughs> Yellow. <laughs> However, they don't always find it funny. Tintin. Tintin. Come, um, come, come, come. We need you as a witness. Okay, so... Before you go you back know, inside. You remember, were you there? You were there that day when I was asking Daddy, can you please buy me V-Box now? Right, so, he doesn't, so he doesn't have to ask me 
I said, can you please buy me V Box now? So you don't have to have to buy me more V Box in the future. Like in the next, you were there. And what did he say? Sir, dear. Thank you. Huh? Thank yeah, you. Go back. Go back. Go back. I'm going to Plus, the surprise Auntie Abimbola said that she will give me. Okay, oh. we'll, we'll discuss it later. Okay. Fatherhood is. It's been great. It gives you a sense of responsibility that you can't really explain or quantify or tell anybody. You just have to live up to the responsibility and, and be, be the man. School fees, food, <laughs> you know, clothes and, and whatnot. And most importantly, you know, trying to be there to um, guide them, you know, and, and nurture them uh, and lead them in the right way. Um, um, and being a dad to them has also inspired me, you know, to also uh, live up to my responsibilities. What qualities do you see in me that you also see in yourself? You are stubborn. <laughs> You're stubborn. Like your father. Um, you like gaming, you know, and that's, mm -hmm. I also like gaming. Um, you're talented, you know, sports, you love sports, I also love sports. You are creative in a way you like to, you're, you're more interested in getting your hands dirty like learning how to do the thing and all that. You don't really like school or tune so much. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what the times means. Is that, what, is that maths or No, this is chemistry. chemistry. I'm sorry, I didn't do chemistry in school. Okay. So I can't really help you. I'll try and figure it out. I'm sure you can, you're smart. to cook. I'm just in the kitchen hanging out with you. Oh, I thought you liked to cook. I can't cook that well. Yeah, you can't. You just believe in yourself. But I think, yeah, I should believe in myself. Yes. Okay, I'll believe in myself. That you do every day. Yeah. Well, definitely not your farting. <laughs> that doesn't make anybody smile. It makes me want to chase you out of the room. Um, one thing you do every day, you know how you wake up in the morning and you come and say good morning to mommy and I. And you give us a long, warm hug. That always makes me smile. I like hugs. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> When you finish, you have to freeze. And you have to, once you finish delivering to the camera, you have to freeze. That's pause. TikTok is more than a social media app to me. It's a bonding tool, a great way to share myself with both the world and my mini me. Yes, those two, those ones. Mini me's that I share with my incredible better half, Deola. Amazon. 
a pillar, strong woman, intelligent, beautiful, uh, smart. Did I say smart already? I can't say that too many times. Um, smart, <laughs> smart. <laughs> um, you know the phrase ride or die? You know, yeah. So it's time to officially launch Ja Guide Me to the World. Ha! The song drops in less than 24 hours along with the music video. So as with any new venture or any new song or any new release, I have to promote it. And what better way to do so than to pay a nostalgic visit to a place that I know so well. Ja Guide Me with Dr. Dio to the TUM on 96.9 Cool FM goes down in about 12 minutes. So. Uh, yeah, I'm just taking you guys along so you can see what's going on behind the scenes. Dotsun's been my boy from way back. Um, he works where I used to work. <laughs> and we're going to be dropping Jack Gabby. First time anybody's going to be hearing it. So, so excited. Let's go. The guy who rocks the show every single time with the best, one of the best ever voice to ever come out of Nigeria. And to say with a lot of energy. And to the only, one and only, Dare! Yo! <laughs> you know. Yo! Oh boy, good bless you. They pay you to those hype. See oh, hype me. See hype me. Hype man of life. The energy guy. Always number one. Energy. Energy. Why did you take this time for the music again? I think I realized that you always have a recess. You pause on studying things. Yeah. I mean, why did, why did you pause? And I, why did you give it this much time? You know. Life Sport 360 is, uh, you know, yeah, people think it's a big deal now, you know, we're doing this, we're doing that, um, and doing it pretty well, you know, but it took a lot of time to focus on, you know, expanding the business, growing the business, putting food on the table for so many different families, you know, uh, providing solutions to our different clients as a creative agency across advertising, digital, you know, um, production, entertainment, etc. But all the while I've been recording. You know, quietly, you know, you know, I've played you so many things over the last two, three years, you know, exclusive stuff, you know, to just let you know that, look, I'm recording. And you know how recording sessions can be and the process. So them feet know, them feet know, them feet know I saw living go. As I prepare to watch the Jai Guide Me music video premiere with my beautiful family, I look back and think about how all those late nights and, of course, early mornings to and fro the studio the past couple of years, you know, recording in and out, it's finally paying off. The world is ready to see what I've been cooking, and I'm ready to show them. On the next episode of Way Home. Absolutely worth it to come out here and um, hang out with these guys. They're absolutely phenomenal. And they did a bit of a dance to Jag Guide Me, which was really cool. Ja Guide Me by Dare, out now on all platforms. Yeah.